Hallelujah. Good evening, good evening. My viewers all over the world. Good afternoon, good morning. Depends on wherever you view me from today. I welcome you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Today's topic is going to be very, very interesting. As you can see up there, share among your friends. Because I want to talk about a very serious issue about the Italian injustice system against the innocent Nigerians. Today I'm not going to be doing preaching, but it's a thing that I promised God that we need to do to free our innocent people in the prison. So this matter has been lingering for long since the year 2000. The Italians injustice and corrupt system though they put many many Nigerians for prison and nobody they talk about them. So it's a pain in my heart that waiting with a suffer for Italy here. So you can share, invite your friends, let's discuss on this topic. Really, I really want to explain in details of what they go on in Italy. How innocent people has been put in prison in Nigeria, in Italy, sorry. Innocent, responsible Nigerians. Many people are languishing in the prison. The family cannot hear from them. Their wife cannot hear from them. Many of them lose their wives, their girlfriends, because they are kept in Italian prison unjustly. It is a wicked and corrupt system that the persecutor, Dr. Stephanie Casalani, is operating, is using against Nigerians and other nationalities, especially black. Dr. Stephanie Casalani is a persecutor in Torino, but he has a way of manipulating all the judges in Italy to sentence and convince anybody where in fit arrest for a no crime. That is why today I want to really describe what is the happen for Italy. It has been lingering for long and it's bad. Nobody is saying anything about it, not until I made the first video before. This is my second video. Not until the ex-commissioner, Mr. Ero, also fall a victim of this particular injustice and corrupt system by Dr. Stefani Casalani. He is the only persecutor in Italy that is fighting Nigerians. I don't know the business he has with them. I don't know what he is, 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 is aim all about. He's a wicked persecutor. Well, first of all, we want to talk about 416Bs. What is the meaning of 416Bs? In the Italian code system, it's an article being used for only mafias. 416Bs is, an, is a criminal code for only mafia. The law was invented in the 1980s by Berlusconi because of mafia where a key they are one of their persecutors, one of their Joey Bomba, and they bring that code for mafias. In the year 2000, that law was abolished because the European Union came to understand that mafia in Italy has finished. That they abolished that code. They told the Italian people to abolish that code. That, that code, since they don't have any mafia again, because now the European Union 
they sponsor any mafia they catch. And imagine a person they tag a mafia that they collect 2,000 euro from the Italian government, from the European government to the Italians. This is how they operate. That is why my book I wrote, I, thought, I titled it Italian Prison Business with the Nigeria Embassy. The book will be coming out shortly. It is bad. Now, when you now go into the 416B code, the article used for mafia, it contains a lot of things. Now, for you to be called a mafia, listen, for you to be called a mafia, it's a great crime in Italy and all over the world. For you to come to be called a mafia, it must possess some certain characters, some certain qualities. Then what are the qualities? Listen, a mafia must have a gun, must be involved in drug trafficking, must be involved in extortion, must be involved in international drug trafficking and local. It must be involved in transportation of arms locally and internationally. It must be a killer. It must have connection with other terrorist organizations in Italy or outside Italy. These are some of the qualities of mafians. So, tell me, if they are using this code for the Italians, who has been involved with this mafia business, drug, trafficking, prostitution, in, in, in this world, such a huge code, how can you not arrest a Nigerian? You now say a Nigerian is a mafia, without a gun, without ammunition, without killing anybody, without doing international drug trafficking, without transporting arms internationally, without extortion, but you can't use the same code. Call them mafia because we don't get anybody we go stand for us. We don't get anybody we go talk for us. Dr. Stephanie Casalani, enough is enough. Stop arresting Nigerians with this your evil code. The things that where did they pay me pass? According to the law, a persecutor work within its region. That is the work of a persecutor. You work within your region. But Dr. Stephanie Casalani have his way of manipulating the Italian system. He can arrest you from every corner when you are in Italy. Padova, Napoli, Torino, whatsoever. When it does not happen, it is only Dr. Stephanie that can threaten a judge to make sure they sentence you. Do you know how many Nigerians suffering inside jail today for crime they know nothing about? Because you, that code will allow you to arrest more than 300 people at a blow. 50, 100, 200. What Castellani has been doing from 2013. The first people he arrested, they are more than 40. The other said 150, the other said 200, the other said 50, the other said 50 something. What did these people just do? And the worst part of this whole situation, when you not take, when they not take these people to court, <laughs> that is the most trickish and the most devilish part. Casalani will dump these people in the Italian prison all over Italy. According to the European Union, in every European country, you have 30,000 prisoners, which will be stipulated. We're supposed to do prison. But Italy has the highest number. 60 something thousand. The European Union don't cry, they don't tire. They say no. The injustice they're using or pretty because of the money they are collecting from the European government. So they tag all blacks, especially Nigerian, as a criminal. Using that same code to the troop there for prison. Because when you are being tagged with 416Bs, they will put you in a maximum prison. 
maximum prison, guarding you 24 hours. You have no space, you have no right to house arrest. You have no freedom, you have no liberty. You can never contact your family. Because, because of the 2,000 euro, the European government is paying for a mafia in a day. That is just a business. Dr. Stephanie Casalani is just interested all about. Very sad. You know, the funnier part is this. It will dump you inside that prison. You will have no contact to your embassy, to anybody. Even the useless Nigeria ambassador, the former ambassador, the useless Nigeria embassy in Rome is the most wicked and the most corrupt embassy all over the world. When they arrest you in Italy, just forget about your embassy. They don't stand for you. They don't even care about you. You can write the old letters in the world to them. They will not answer you. But try it with Ghana embassy. Try it with Senegal embassy. Try it with other embassies. Their ambassador will visit that person in the prison and ask, what did really happen? Because they want to hear from you. They want to hear what happened before they will take side. But the Nigeria ambassador will take side because of the money wherein they see they collect from this so-called injustice system in Italy. Because they are still paying him to keep quiet. I have all the evidence. I have all the proof that they are working together. I have all the proofs. I have submitted a petition and this proof in Strasbourg. Yes, this is a battle that can never end. I have promised myself to fight for those in the prison. And this is what I'm doing. So, the thing, after they dump you, you cannot even have any legal way to have a proof to prove you're innocent. They will put you in the prison six months, one year, you don't even know your fate. Before they will, come, they will tell you they are still investigating where you are in prison. According to the law, you cannot put somebody in the prison and doing your investigation. You are supposed to conclude your investigation before arresting that person so that you can have a proof to persecute that person. But no, the Italian system allowed them to arrest that person, put the person in the prison one year, two years, three years. They are investigating until they will conclude that you are there in the prison. At the end of it all, they may see you as an innocent or guilty. But you've wasted your three years, your two years, or your one year in the Italian prison. Nigerians are languishing in the prison. No money, no care, no money to even carry a lawyer. They are giving their government lawyer. What can a government lawyer do in a case of mafia? The most painful part is, after this whole thing, Dr. Casalani will still come and meet your lawyer. For your lawyer to beg you. For you to accept the short process because he has nothing against you what does it mean by short process what do you mean short process mean that everything where they write they arrest you they go usually down and take judges when you accept the short process in case you are guilty they will sentence you with a small sentence but if you are take the long process which it may last for two years three years then the both of them they bring proof they come because of the the, the, the injustice of the doctor Stephanie Casalani in not need because he have no proof against you he will force your lawyer to come and force you to accept that short because you know the long process is going to lose the battle then your lawyer will not come because they are all they are all Italians I will not be able to tell you my brother accept it we will do it fast you will go home you will not be persecuted you know we are innocent you have no choice because you are under duress. You want to meet your family. You want to meet your loved ones. You want to meet your, your children, your wife. You don't want to lose your family. So most people will accept the short process. But if you accept the short process, after the process, if you are found guilty, your, pro, your, your sentence will reduce. But uh, the possibility of you being guilty is there because now in right waiting, they take arrest you. You go say now waiting in right, they want to judge the case. You don't bring any proof. That be mean of short process. But the long process, not be waiting in right. Now they prove where you go bring, where you go bring. So you don't need that one. Then, how can you not fight against somebody who arrives something against you? You see, now lay down and want a judge case. How is it done? It's never possible. But that is how they are operating in the Italian system.
So when you not accept that short process, the Stefano you call balance. You say yes, you don't win. And they are ninety nine percent because the Italian system get they have theory process theory, first trial, second trial, the third one. They are ninety nine percent that in the first process, in the first trial, you must be sentenced because. The, the, the Stephanie is the Dr. Stephanie Casalan, the persecutor, is the one controlling the judge because the judge has no say. Because the judge is even afraid of the persecutor. Because if you refuse to do his binding, you might be indulging if he investigates that uh, judge because they are all corrupt, they know themselves. So he will be obliged to do the will of the persecutor. So they are ninety nine percent. So you must be sentenced. This is how they sentence all Nigerians. Why? Because he get target, and he get reason. And the reason is because after he sentence you, instead of giving you fourteen years, they also they can give you eight years. Eight years now shall play for prison. Then you will not say you want to go appeal because you know you will go to appeal to go and appeal that judgment. So what will call happen? In the process of appeal, they will come meet you. This is where the game, this is where the logic, this is where the system, this is where the corrupt system operates. They will not come and meet you. They tell you, my brother, they will send your lawyer now. Say so you know they gave you eight years. The way the whole matter be now. Now during this whole trial, there is no proof. The the prosecutor cannot provide one proof. Knife, drug, gun, prostitution. They will remove everything because there is no proof. Even the judge at times, they would be asking this persecutor, Sir, you brought this person in for this particular case. Can we see the evidence? It will not. Is 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 explanation is, 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 is they they've been doing it, or we are thinking that they will do it, but that one is not a a, a crime. You say they are Nigerian mafias. They are doing prostitution, but no proof. They are Nigerian mafias. They are killing, no proof. They are Nigerian mafia. They belong to one court. They belong to one society, but no drug to show. No international arm to show. But why are you not giving them that code? Why don't you arrest them? If somebody is selling cocaine, arrest him for his cocaine. If somebody is doing drug business or prostitution, arrest that person for the prostitution. If that person is fighting, arrest that person for his fighting. The way they do it with other Italians. Don't say because this one is fighting, this one is selling drugs, you will not bring God together. Because the code allows you to arrest more than 50 people together. You will not bring them together as a group case saying they are doing it together. Whereas, they don't even know themselves. A Torino person can call somebody in Treviso, in Padova, in Parma. They will bring up the they say they are mafias. How are they operating mafia? Because they have phone conversation. I tell you today, in your phone conversation in Italy, it's being recorded every day. If you tell somebody to buy you a, buy you beer from the supermarket, they will say it is a drug. If you ask somebody to bring a rapper for you from Nigeria, they will say it's a drug. Because our useless set of Nigerians working with the Italian police are the one interpreting those things to the police that this is what Nigerians are doing. Without evidence, or the the most of the Nigerians they are they are police informants. They are doing it because of money, because of documents. We know these people. They are in Torino, Padova, Parma. Nigerians working with the Italian police, working with it is not my problem. But give them the right to information to arrest the right co culprit, not arresting innocent souls. Because you hate that girl, you hate that boy, you go there and lie. So they will put that person in prison. This is wrong. And the useless Nigerian embassy is even doing the worst. The former ambassador. I thank God that is, they removed him from that place. He has collected a lot of money from the Italian government to keep quiet, not to defend any Nigerians. Nigerians in the prison, they've written more than millions of letters. No one is replied. No one saw a, anybody that came from the embassy to ask, my brother, my sister, did you really do this thing? But the Nigerians are suffering in the prison for crime or for one since be they know nothing about. No proof, no evidence. What is the most funniest thing? 
When you now go to a P, where you are supposed to get your freedom, the chief persecutor will now come, will send your lawyer to come and meet you that they are going to reduce your sentence from 8 years, 15 years down. Because you, they gave 15 years without, without proof. 10 years, you are, you are like a dead man in the prison. So when they will not tell your lawyer to come and meet you, to come and make an agreement with you, to accept the crime, the proscribed crime by Dr. Stephanie Carter, the persecutor who arrested you, so that your sentence can be reduced from 8 years to 4 years, 15 years to 10 years. My brother, what will you do? You are tired. No cause. No letters. Nothing. Your wife has left you. Your children has left you. What will you do? Your lawyer will not come, will not be able to tell you, we have a proposal for you, and it's good. Just try to accept it so that they will reduce your sentence, so that you can finish your sentence on time. This is what I'm talking about. Maybe you've done three years. They say they want to give you five years. You say, I've done two years to make your dorm. May I take them? Then they will not force the Nigerians to accept that code of, four, of mafia, 416 bis, that they are mafia, so that their sentence can be reduced, so that they can go home. This is just the business, the triangle. And most of the most of the Nigeria police informants, most of them are being arrested. They will ask them to become an informant so that they can release them. So they will release you after becoming an informant to testify falsely against your fellow Nigerians, against your fellow brother, against your fellow sister. For you to gain your freedom. At the end of it, what did you gain? Nigerians, let's stand together and fight this injustice in Italy. Nigerians, let's come together to say no to injustice. Nigeria, let's come together as one. Let's fight against corruption in this land of Italy. Let's say no to illegal arrest. I'm not saying they should not arrest anybody that commit crime. I'm not saying they should not sentence those that are kicking against Italian law. Arrest them, persecute them according to their law, to their crime. Persecute them according to what they did. Persecute them according to the things that they've done. It is wrong. And the Nigeria embassy and the ambassador, the new one, God will bless you. Please. Don't follow the full step of your predecessor. Who took that office as his personal office to extort money both from the Italians and from the Nigerians? I know what I'm saying. And this message goes. There are other good judges who will see the case and say, no, I can't do such a thing. Many good judges from the court of appeal have set many Nigeria free because the evidence brought by them by Dr. Stephen Castana does not hold water. The judges will say no. Free these people. They free men in Palermo, in Sardinia, because they see that these people are not mafia. That Nigeria does not have a mafia. Nigeria does not have mafia. Even if they are courtists or they are confraternity members, sentence them if they commit crime with their confraternity, not calling them mafias. <coughs> if they are fighting, arrest them and say that according to two fighting. Don't say they are mafia. Nigeria does not have mafia. Many people are falling victim of this thing. And it's time for us to say no. Let's come together. Africans, let's come together. Let's unite. Italy is supposed to be a beautiful country, a peaceful country. But most of the persecutors that are wicked are using the blacks for their trade. How can you call a black man without a proven mafia? 
somebody who has been working in, fab in company, in fabrica. Somebody who has a store. Somebody that is paying his tasks. Somebody that has been laboring in this country, you call the person a mafia. What kind of mafia? How can you arrest a Nigeria person? You are seeing that person is a mafia without a gun, without drug, without nothing. You will, you will even arrest some people with drug. You will not call them mafia. You will give them two years. You will set them free. Because you have a means that you want to tarnish the image of somebody. You will call that person a mafia without any single proof. The injustice that we are suffering, the racism in Italy is becoming too much. Nigerians, stop selling yourselves because of documents, because of money. You've turned yourself to become a tool of information to the Italian police and their persecutor. Just because you are looking for documents and money, then you want to put your brother and your sister Somebody that is strongly with his African shore, you will go and tell the police that that person is doing drug business, that that person is doing legal trade. Out of jealousy and wickedness. You think that God is going to forgive you and your family and your generation and your children? Why are you into this old man? A man that has children, you will dump that man in the prison. And the funniest thing, the minute you are arrested, if you are a popular person in your society, a friend that will be helping your community, you will have friends that you guys have been doing together, immediately you are being arrested, everybody will run away from you. Even people that is calling you daddy, only pastor, this one, they all will run away. They will be the one to be mocking you. They will say, no man, nah. if, they, if they do oga, if they do big woman, in the back and then they change career yeah, for every day get money, they will be the one judging you before the judge. No man now, make you go suffer there. They do this and they do that one. You will not, you will, that is, you, even if you manage to have their contact and you write it, they will not reply you. They will say, I beg you, make you carry a while they go. Make carry a while they go. I know what I'm talking about, but immediately you are free. You will see them begin to congratulate. Oh, my brother, thank you, though. Thank God, though. I will not say you're not doing. You know, say you're not doing. But they've condemned you. They will not begin to re they begin to, to, re to, 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 to try to find a solution to replenish their evil deed against you, my brother. I just run away from those people. They are not your friends. You have no friends. You have nobody. Stay in the right track. But remember, if a man not fall, he's not going to stand. And any man and woman will never get temptation for life. That person never arrive. As a man and a woman, especially in Europe, you must get temptation. In one way or the other. The temptation will build you up, will make you strong, will make you to know your left and your right. These things will build you up. Because we are living in a racist country, a country that is persecuting Nigerians, especially Nigerians. A country that is destroying Nigerians. What did we do? A lot of Nigerians are doing genuine work. I know a lot of Nigerians do company work, fabrica work, have Africa shop, have businesses. But the Italian police will not give them rest. They keep disturbing them until they destroy them and their company, until they destroy their business, until they destroy their image. Because our person is working with the Italian police, with the persecutor to push in us. To use that code of 416Bs, Italian Mafia code being used for Mafians, for Nigerians. Why? Why? Do we have Mafia in Nigeria? No. Why can the Niger why must the Nigerian ambassador not accept that code to be used for Nigerians in the prison? Why? If he knows that we don't have Mafia in Nigeria, why now a persecutor in Italy will say we are in Nigerian Mafias? They will put it all over the news. The, the, the ambassador will sit down, he will keep, keep quiet. Can you try to the American citizen, to the Spanish citizen? Can you try to the Italian citizen, the American citizen, the, the Ghanaians? Can you call them mafians when they don't have mafians in their country? The ambassador will stand and speak for them. The embassy will speak for them. Our embassy is supposed to be our home. But that place is not our place of terror. 
Go to the Nigerian embassy in Rome, go and see what is happening there. It's a place of terror. It's just business. You give me, I give you. It's bad. I want to appeal to the good persecutor of Italy. Do not imitate Dr. Stephanie Casalani, that evil persecutor that has been raising Nigeria all over in Nigeria, all over Italy. You will leave Torino to come and be arresting people in different kind of oh, the, the, oh, the, the, the part of Italy. What does it happen? You have your region. Why Dr. Stephanie cannot operate in his region? Why must he cross over to Torino? From Torino to Treviso to Verona to Sardinia to be arresting innocent Nigerians. How is it possible? Against the constitution of the Italian, this is wrong. You cannot leave your region. A persecutor have his own region. How can you not leave your region? Go to 800 kilometers. Start arresting people because you want to make money because you are the one that knows how to define mafia. And you are even arresting these people without any code, without any proof. Not even a knife. No talk of drug. You say because it them say, who say, this one say, because that uh, informant say, that informant not say, this one not say. Then, when the, the evil informant, when the judge go over, they ask this persecutor, what is the crime of this person? The funniest thing the, the, the persecutor will say, uh, I was thinking that they, they are trying to organize a mafia organization. I am thinking, or I was thinking, that what happened in the year 2000, that is what they want to do now. Ito, how, how is it possible, say, what the person they think could become a crime? As a persecutor when you go to school, do they think, say, this person want to go to arrest for J? Which crime? Which crime? He do. Do they think as a persecutor you go to school? A crime is supposed to be carried out or an attempt to carry out that crime in that scene of that environment before you arrest that person. In every other part of the European country, you don't try such a thing until that person is found guilty. It can even, like Germany and France, not until they sentence you, you cannot go to prison. Where in Italy, they will not arrest you first. They will not do investigation when you are in the prison. You know, if you go outside, go find proof. They will lock you. Only they go to bring proof. How you want to walk around? You never see money take a lawyer. How do you want to do one? In every other country, they give you time. They tell you, they will bring a case file for you that you will be attending court. Then from house, you will be piling your investigation. You go, they attend the court case until the final judgment before they will say they sentence you from the Supreme Court before you go to prison, go servant. They will give you all the chance to use all the legal means. But Italy, no. They will put you for prison. You know if you call anybody, they will, they, they will the judge. Ah, which proof you want proof? What do you want to tell You never get your boost papaga you want to submit. If you call your guy, he's not going to answer you. You call your neighbor, he's not going to answer you. Where you want to provide your working document? And you want to provide anything? Where you never get anything? Do they take arrest you? Now you'll be your proof that very day. Till when they go, where you go, they go serve all your prison or they free you. Now let God be your proof. Now let God be your witness. Because nobody's coming. No Nigeria will come say, God testify. Say, no, this man is free. This man is innocent. Nobody. Now let you and your God. Your wife will go who come there. No. Your brother will go who come there. Now lay you and your God. No. What kind of country will they? You can see two Nigerians with a quarry. Do I go tell police lie? That boy is a drug dealer. That boy is a killer. That boy is a woman. Yash. Why boy is this one? Then the information where that person go give police. police go to arrest. Go to the you know, see him. You know, investigate him. There was a funny case where they ever arrest a woman. On the case of the on the day of the trial, now the judge asked the prosecutor, "What did this woman do?" And he said, "We well, yes, say he call person go up and go buy a vino come. He said, but the vino na drug na it be. Now the person where the drug? He said, eh, now what did they interpret? Okay, you don't say drug. Say go buy vino for supermarket. Me, he said, because somebody interpret for them say vino me drug, clot me drug, towel me igbo." But if you do tower me, Igbo, and you can't follow my phone, I say, go ahead me buy a tower come. But you don't follow me, go to the supermarket, me, you look at the red the tower. Or you don't follow me, go to me, you release it, and the tower at the back. You can't follow me, rich house. You know, they, they just conclude, say, that Igbo, now I go buy. Then you can't put me for prison. They say, because of, I say, buy me cloth, buy me this one, I be Igbo, I be drug. What kind of country are we living in? Italy change. Evil persecutor change. 
These are the people destroying the Italian justice system. These are the people disturbing the Italian justice system. But it's very wrong. I'm only doing this video today to beg all Nigerians that we, we should stop destroying ourselves in this land. We should not be fighting against ourselves, no matter the money they promise you, all the drug they promise you, all the document they promise you. Don't betray your brother. And those in the prison, more not think say they commit the crime, more they pray for them. They not commit what they talk about them. They lie, say they be mafia. Mafia without gun. How can a mafia be in a prison not see money to pay lawyer? How can a mafia be in the prison not see money to buy soap? You know, somebody they buy food. You know, somebody they buy cloth. You they call them mafia. Where the mafia money? You know, they call mafia. Mafia, they are done. They have money. They are big boys. They have people working for them. When you arrest them, money they flow. But how can you call in Nigeria a mafia? You don't even see money they eat. Even for you to even send that money, no problem. You never see money they pay lawyer. Now government lawyer. Now they give most of the Nigerians more than three hundred Nigerians all over prison in Italy. But you they call them mafia. How come? Why is it possible? Our Nigerian ambassador, I beg, look into this matter. Make sure you fight for those innocent people in the prison. And not say all of them are innocent. The one where they carry with Igbo, may they sentence her with Igbo. Two years, three years go serve in prison, ten years. The one where do woman trafficking, may they sentence her with the woman trafficking. But not the same Nigerian mafia. Where did they call mafia? It is wrong. Nigerians, let's come together. Let's fight this fight. Let's put our hands together to say no to this racist country, to no to injustice. I know say the pain to get victory. But remember, no pain, no gain. The ex commission of Edosis have started this battle. Let's support this movement. I they beg. Because it happened to me today, if it happened to you tomorrow. Nobody free for Italy. Nobody. You feel they drive new car today for Italy, fine car. You go they drive fine car today for Italy, they'll say you be mafia. If you happen to you. Hey, because anything when black man they do, they see as crime. Yeah, they see as crime. No, not everybody doing to crime for Italy. No, not everybody. We have good citizens. We have good as the law. We've been in Italy for more than 18 years. How can somebody be in a country for 18 years? Then at the end, you see the person a mafia. How is it possible? Do company work, do fabric work. Some 16 years, some 15 years, some 14 years, some 10 years. They are working, they are paying their tasks. They, they call them mafia. How is it possible? Even if they have a way where they don't do anything wrong, why don't you question them about what they did wrong and bring them to book according to what they've done? If a Nigerian man buy a house, no problem for Italy. They have something they will pay cash, no problem. How you take buy a house? Your dress work is a problem. Your director for work will give you personal problem. We want to share this message. Nigerians, we will not betray ourselves. Ambassador for Italy, stand up for Nigerians. Let's fight against this injustice. Dr. Stephanie Castana, the persecutor of Torino, is the one causing this havoc in Italy, painting Nigerian blacks. I've met that man one on one. He looks innocent in it, but he's devil in nature. He's working with a lot of Nigerians. And I want to advise all the Nigerians living in, it, in Torino please stay away from any group. Stay away from any confraternity. The Italian system is not favorable to anyone belonging to any group. I know the group, your people are not using it for crime or whatsoever. But the Italian system said, no, stop it. Because if they arrest you, now mafia crime, they won't give you, you don't do anything. They'll say 15 years, 20 years, without any evidence. Because among Guna there, now informant today, we not get document. We go to tell police, say, you na killer, you na this, you na that. Among Guna there. In my next video, I'm going to call the name of all the informants in Italy when I know. 
And I, what are the talk? I get proof, I get evidence. I'm not just the carry the talk, say I want to talk on social media. I'm an apostle. I'm supposed to be preaching the word of God. But today he touched me and said, No, I must educate our people. I must put a stop to this evil deed. All the evil doers, all the informants, stop this thing and give your life to God. Not put your sister for problem. Not put your brother for problem. That boy and that girl with a friend each other will not fight. You call court police. Not go tell police that the boy can't call for a Nigeria because they do a shower. Not be the boy. Not because of annoyance put your brother for prison. Many for their prison. At the end, they'll call that person mafia. And the person will not be who carry you comes because of a quarrel. My sister, will you be happy? See somebody all day prison because of you for five years, ten years. Because you see, now I carry you come. The same thing with that boy. Because. <laughs> oh, the sister refused. You can't go test now, your sister, now I carry her because they do woman business. What the annoyance go feel do to you? We go you make you just carry your brother, your sister for police nets. In a country, we have police. Like Italy, where they do their work. Let them do their work. No go they carry information where no good to the police to arrest your brother. Most guests, I want to tell you now, most of the guests being arrested, be, uh, uh, responsible for the arrest of all Nigerians. Because their boyfriend beat them. Their, see, their boyfriend beat them. They go go police, they go tell police, that boy is not a court boy. The boy not caught boy. I know his friends will be caught this. I know his friends will they sell drug. All of them are caught. Because when you don't tell police one information, you go carry your friend, make her testify. You can and police don't go investigate for you in the park all of them. Then out of the 80 where they go arrest, 10 go come out as, as informant because they want go out. Because they don't want to suffer again. Because they don't want to stay in prison. They will tell police, hey, I want to just talk. And I'm saying you want to talk with the problem. Why you not talk the truth? Why you can't go the lie? Say this person, now I do and the person not even do anything. Have you ever seen anywhere for Europe in Nigerian man go fake Nigerian man without police not go know? That they go write everything for your case file. Now the judge, where God go bless. Now they look into some of all these cases where God send may stand for you. May God stand for you. Now the judge go say, ah, this crime is not possible. He go say, this crime, this person not do one. Now I make many of our Nigeria, like what happened in, uh, in a Palermo after three years. Even seen that could come out, could testify, say those people they are not mafia. You know them. They, they do shorty. Yes, that they, they drink oh, that they, they fight, but they are not mafia. After three years, with some Nigerians who will not accept the short process. With some lawyers from London. Then they, they set all those places free. They give some 15 years before, some 10 years. Some eight years, some five years. Those who are doing format, they get their three years. But now God grace, then the judge say, look and say, no, these people are not mafia. Even to the Supreme Court, Cassazione in Italy, he write and come out boldly. I get all everything with me. He said Nigerians are not mafia. He said, but if they do any crime, arrest them, persecute them according to their crime. He said, but Nigerians are not mafians. Then why is the persecutor, Dr. Stephanie from Torino? See, using that evil code. They call them 416 bis. Any way they don't put bis and join her. That means uh, you not get any right as a prisoner for us arrest in not your day. It doesn't have 20 years, not 20 years. Now, maximum prison you they go. Maximum prison, not be local prison. Whether they guard you 24 hours. Where you not get voice. Then they take you like they put you join deadly criminals. Whether they carry gun, they guide. There was a Nigeria boy called a Hosa. They pour oil. They send their Italian pest with the city for their prison to pour oil, hot oil 
for the boy body because the boy was protesting inside prison, say he's an innocent of the crime where they say he commits. They poor all year. If you see the boy body, he born. Nigeria embassy, the right and not reply. They were maltreating the boy. The other one, they beat on the ear. For inside prison, they repeat person for European prison. He hear boss water. All the police were there inside the beat on the boy today. He hear the leak. Nobody to fight for them. You call them mafia. You do you know the funniest things? If the 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 the, the even the the, the 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 criminals, the mafias, where these Nigerians they meet inside the prison, you get a question whether they ask them. When they have to say Nigeria mafia and those more are welcome. They go ask you a question. What do you do? You say you don't do anything. No. They say you join court. They say you pass. So they say you fight person. They will say you don't lie. Say you don't lie. They will say, how can somebody fight? Or you join something. Now I make you the. He said, no. He goes, so I don't know what it be mafia. He goes, mafia. They will call the final. Say, mafia is a person where they keep person. Where they get gone. Where they do international drug business. Where they sell arms. Where they sell houses. Where they do extortion. He goes, say, which of what which one you do? You say you don't do anyone. They will shake it. They say that they use Nigeria instead of complete prison. No. Because anybody where they arrest, European Union, they pay 2,000 euro daily for head of one mafia. Because European Union don't need mafia for euro. So that is why when they arrest Nigeria, they will put that code for head. Because they don't say we did two or four years, you go come out, they will get, calculate 2,000 for four years for your head. Whether they pay for your head. So that is how the Italian government they function. That is how their prison business they function. That is how the economic they function because their company don't close. They don't get work again for Italy. The only work with the investor is police arresting illegally, persecuted. That is how the money they flow. Then they self know how this money they flow within them just for prison business. But if they pay me, so they call the use Nigerian. And the useless ambassador will forget. He supported this deal because money they pass through, often make it keep quiet. Do you know what is embassy? That is our legal home. But today it's our illegal home. You can't go there. You can't even, they can't even reply you. They even the embassy have condemned all the Nigerians in Italy as, as criminals, as prostitutes, as drug dealers, and everybody. Not everybody. Not everybody. But they don't already condemn everybody. So today we are living in Italy with risk, with fear. If you say A, you are in problem. If you say B, you are in problem. Your right is not even there again. We are living in a state, not democracy. The politicians are even using Nigerians for their personal business. So, my beloved, I want to beg on Nigerians. With this small lecture, what I give on us, so, make we stay out of crime. Because the country not favor us again. Make we stay out of trouble. Because your fellow citizen, your fellow brother and sister, he don't go interpret you until you talk. Say, can, can, Igbo, uh, in I be Igbo, beer, me cocaine. Talk with me on another thing. Your fellow Nigerian, now go tell police what you mean because they're jealous of you because you back out, you they walk. There was, it was last two weeks or last three weeks, a carabinieri. He stopped one Nigerian man because the guy they drive a fine car. He they asked the man, so which work? Then the man tell him, he has been working for the country for the past 25 years. He they asked him, which kind of work you they work? Then the man said, he not get right. He be an Italian citizen. He not get right to drive a good car. See, can you ask an Italian man such question? Or in UK, can the police ask you that? We have for see money to buy a car. Or in Germany, what kind of rubbish talk? They ask the man after 25 years where they work legally in Italy. You have for see money they back. How much have we got 10,000 euro? We in UK, men are pulling 25,000 pounds, 50,000 pounds in Germany, in France. What kind of country are we living? God, have mercy. And those involved in their so called confraternity. I beg of you, disassociate yourself from anything group because Italy don't target every confraternity as 416 bis. Your prison, as a leader of that confraternity, is from 15 years. As a member 
your prison is from five years to ten years as a member. As a leader, it's from 10 to 20, 25. You join any meeting for Nigeria, apart from confraternity, any team meet, any group, because there is a code there. You just say, where one or two, three are gathered, Carabinieri is in the midst. One of them be the Carabinieri will be the midst. And any group they gather for Italy that is not registered for Italy is illegal. And they, 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 they don't already write us in a form one says we say that because there be group. They say don't know what they do for that group. Because of it, they don't know. They go arrest all of them. They will go put them for prison. Now for the prison, they don't call the talk. What they do for the group, if they are guilty or not, without investigation. You will even get Africa shop, be very careful. Your brother and yourself will call they buy something for you and a spy. He called they know whether or not they do things we're not clear. So that they will come, put you in prison. That be the joy. They are blood suckers, document suckers. Please, let's pray for the release of those innocent Nigerians. They get children, they get family. We know the year from them. Some don't lose their wife. Some wife don't abandon them because the years where they give their husband too much. 10 years, 15 years. The woman said, You take wait. She will carry one picky or two wrong. Put it on that man. If that man can come back, I want to start life. I want to begin. Any of you now get connection, Mona talk to the, our ambassador. Any of you now we get any help to reach any prisoner, make you write and come on, I na something to that prisoner. Any of you now we know somebody who is in their prison, Mona console them, Mona they pray. Not everybody be criminal. <laughs> This now God don't stand for me. That make us when God do them, I go testify and I will say tell our people what did they happen for Italy. It is wrong. Let's stay away from anything. Nigerians, if you go club, no they fight. If you go club, no they fight. If drink no good for your body, avoid them. Drink for your ass, stay in your house. Not the beat too much for club. Not the fight too much for house. If your girlfriend offend you, your wife offend you, carry shit when you come off as not beaten. Because one police don't come a problem. Maybe tomorrow you define document or you define passport. You don't already get that thing. They'll say that thing where they write for them. You know if it make you get passport because you beat gay, because you beat woman, or you beat your wife, or you fight. You don't put stain for your career. I beg, more we'll follow God. If you go club, go enjoy. If you see people, they make misbehave, go house. If you be in Nigeria, all the club where they for Italy, Nigeria, don't you fight, they scatter all of them. Now, cause all these problems. All the bar where they Italy, Nigeria, don't you fight, scatter all of them. They, they do different things. That is why all these things verse Italo because they use code for those who are not supposed. For me to call you now for it in a problem. For you to call the next person a problem because they, they monitor all of our call. Because Nigeria is a suspect in Europe. All over the world. Because we have a useless president. We sell our rights. We sell our rights. I remember last two years, they arrest some group of mafians. That is Russian mafias. Russia, we know they call mafia. Russian, they are mafia. They arrested them. But you know what it is, the president of? He said they should not ever, he tell Italy, don't ever call them mafias. If they commit crime, persecute the accord, but not say Russian mafia, not try them. Now, the following day, now they cancel that thing. Russian mafia, they, cause, they sent those who are according to their crime, they cancel the mafia. The same thing with Chinese, we get the highest mafia, where they arrest on Chinese. The president say fi year on. Our president where he talk, he say arrest them, put them. They are Nigerian mafia. They are the mafia there. Where full and he the key terrorists, Buari, your people. They are the key people. You not call the mafia. You they call the South Satan a mafia. Auto waiting. I not blame you now. Now because of the confraternity, 
way come when many people rob their body, where they don't know their left and their right, both winch and wizard, both small people they join, come begin they do robbery, they kill themselves. How you go join confraternity, they kill yourself. Now better thing, yeah, be. You join confraternity. You never know the meaning. You they carry gun, they kill your fellow people. You say you be a ye, you be mouth, you be this one. Is that not stupidity? How can you be killing your fellow brother? You're killing your fellow sister. For what? You join confraternity to do waiting. If confraternity good, now I make you join. The waiting come make you got a key. You say you want to join confraternity to fight against the government. Now the government may be your fellow person with the key. Now be your rugged man. That one has stupidity. You that belong to a confraternity. Where you say you don't get sense. You, your own, you deserve in killing. That kid won a key. Now me many people today. So what today for Italy? Your former leaders, they are targeted. They are, they, they record the kingpin. Because they call you. You call the chema, chemo, this one. At the end, they go to the police because you call them. After you don't do evil, you call them on phone. They say, since you call them, they then join you. What is confraternity? Check dictionary. Look the meaning of confraternity. It is a middle of fraternity together among your brothers. Help yourself in one way or the other. But it comes out south. Now call change jam to Kamuka. Rubbish. Killing. Fighting. Auto waiting. Then they give certificate for killing. Killing. Certificate or give you. Say you keep pass. No. They say if you the smoke, it will not go to stop her. You people should abolish anything that will drag you into a problem. Stay away from crime. If by paraventure you become a member of a confraternity in the higher institution, the very day you left that school, stay away from confraternity. Go and face the outside world. Go and get a job. Take off your family and your wife. That's all. At times in a life, somebody can make a mistake. We cannot judge you by your mistake, but we can judge you by your action or after reaction. I beg you now, with the Italy. Let's stop confraternity. Let's come together as one Nigeria. Let's speak against the evil embassy we have in Rome. Let's speak against the persecutors we have that is putting innocent Nigeria in prison. I don't know if you understand. Nigeria is so far inside prison. No food, nothing. No clothes. Some of them is men. Some get injuries. Some get sickness. No cure. It is bad. And they feel the pains. Because if they commit the crime, I know, I know, I know, I talk. It's a normal thing. But they don't commit the crime. In Palermo, a Nigeria person died inside prison. Yes, what did make him not to pay me for that one way he died? That one a former informant where he put more than 200 Nigerians for prison. Police call go the guy that because he go give wrong information where they take arrest those Nigerians. Now when those people call go appeal court, now somebody call come say that person where he say we do this, we not do one. Now the judge where God send say, he want to see that person where he talk the thing where he take arrest these people. He said, because you know, if you just sent this people without hearing from both sides, a good judge, we God go bless for Palermo. Then the ghost they go find this boy, his name, Lady Maker. I'm not going to swear for him because I'm a pastor. I would have said, make his soul not rest in peace. But may God grant his soul eternal peace. Then they go, go find this and make her. Police take time, be they find with the dodge. And they go to remove her. Come. Three days to wait the one present a maker for court. Now police go court on that thought. They say a maker died for prison. A maker where enough they sick. A maker where fair get house where police they guide. You know, say a maker died for prison. How is it possible say a maker to die for prison? Because the telling police not to want make a maker come confess the truth before the judge. Because he knows the judge go ask a question. He go ask a proof. And the police don't get that proof. Now they take a maker for inside prison. They say a maker die for prison. How can a maker die automatically inside prison? Yes, Bible talker. Say somebody go die for you to move ahead. As a maker, they die. Now that judge they release that 150 Nigerians. Because a maker now put them for prison with lies. But God intervened and sent a maker away and they freed those people. 
This is the business they are doing. Imagine those boys who spent three years. Calculate the money where the European Union pay for the Adidas Mafia. Imagine the name where, where they spoil those boys. Imagine most of their wife and their girlfriend all wrong. Imagine the pains when they make a cost for those boys' body. Imagine the prosecutor. What did they do to those Nigerians? Imagine the useless Nigerian ambassador, former Yusuf, will not talk. Even when the maker die, could you believe the Nigerian ambassador did not go? Go ask what he key a maker. They have a right ambassador. They say they bring money, come here, get a certificate. You know, even know what he can never interest. You know, give the interest. What kind of country are we living in? And today, they are, they are still arresting Nigerians. The information reached me recently. They arrested other Nigerians, more than 150 or 100. And some Nigerians also come out as an informant, say yes, they want to testify against them with no proof. No proof. There's a boy I don't interview, so, where they say arrest. In his trial, they don't see proof. People will even talk against it, but when they call, they don't even know the boy for face. They reach the judge as they say, I know this boy, say no. And when this boy has seen a mafia, I don't know the boy. But when I say the boy is a mafia, they carry about four of their corn. Even though you book out his face, they say, You both say, No, no, the boy. Black person, no, say, No, no. But now this boy, when I say, a mafia, then the judge he free that boy for Treviso. How come? What did they happen? Let's change our hearts. Let's stand as one. And they beg. More we'll pray for those innocent. May God free them. Many of them they go appeal court. Many of them they go Supreme Court to go get their freedom. More we'll pray for them. May God touch the heart of a better judge. Make it look into their case. May it wipe away their tears. The only hope anybody gets for Italy when you don't enter your case, never be their Supreme Court. Those ones not they do by us. That is where people they pray make their rich. But the problem, before you go rich there, all the persecutors will be evil. They go try to damage that career for a peak court. The first me you accept the crime to reduce your, your sentence. Once you don't accept crime, what is Supreme Court work or talk? Where be say you don't accept so you're not a mafia. Supreme Court don't get anything to do again. Because this is where they wait for the Nigerians. Because we don't want to stay prison. We don't want to stay for prison. We go accept the crime. Then at the end, you know, if we move our heads, Nigerians are suffering. We don't know our rights. Many of us refuse to go to school in Italy. We don't want to know the law. The ignorance they worry with Nigerians. Like in UK, Nigerians have opportunity of going to, to further their education, to know more about their constitution. Like every other country. Before they go to integrate you into some other country, they'll tell you their constitution. Italy can never show you their constitution. They will just carry you when you join. They give you documents to this remain because if they give you the laws and the constitution, if they integrate you properly, they will know so you will not get anybody. Because the only way Italy can survive as a nation, listen to me, the only way they can survive as a nation, it is through crime. Now then they bring the drugs they give Nigerians, they say. Now then they give the then the woman they do press, they give the connection house and everything for Napoli for Palermo. Then they see them. But they're not going to arrest those guys who do the prostitution. They go, they arrest person in one life for person who carry the con. How can you see somebody do prostitution? They get more than 50 houses. You're not going to go block and you're not close on. But you define person who carry the con. Imagine. That means you're encouraging crime. You know where boys they sell drugs. You're not going to go block that place, close the place. You let them say. When they don't say finish, you can't go arrest them. You'll say, where they carry the drug con. And on our way, be the time as they give the Nigerian the drug they sell. What are we not talking? Do you want to clear that country for a free crime society? No. Italy, if you get a clear, no money again. That is the only way Italy they survive, through drug, through crimes. That is the only way. The judges, the lawyer, the persecutor, the money they turn around like this. They don't get company again. The only way the money they come out through that way because the European Union, they pack money into Italy to the fight criminals, to the fight mafia. And there's no mafia again. No single mafia for Italy. Because they don't arrest all their mafia finish. They're not cause you they want to arrest again. They can't put up for Nigeria body. Say Nigeria. Four months is beast. Say they arrest Nigeria. We are there. It has single proof. My brothers and my sisters, God bless you for watching. Share this video. Let the world be synthesized with which they are put for Nigeria for, for Italy. We will talk to our ambassador. May go find out what is the apple to the people perishing in the Italian prison. 
even if the Nigerians commit crime, it is the right of an ambassador to reach there, go ask, what did you do? This way they really talk, you do them. Um. I don't have to reach your family. My brother, nobody fall for heaven. They get family, no matter the crime where they commit. A terrorist will still be rich. If they arrest her, they see, they see family, we go to see her. They see, they see embassy, we go to see her. Ah, you okay? Are they treating you well? But Nigeria, we know every region level. Ambassador does the business. Now, for you to call do passport, 500 euro, nine day after. To collect money, nine day after. To call do fully rosa. In not day after your welfare, what kind of an ambassador do we have? The Italian embassy is the worst embassy worldwide. And we have the worst president Nigeria can ever record. So I so I reverse. But the spirit of God that is in me is giving me power. He has shown me another way of living. That is why I'm encouraging each and every one of us to stay away from crime, troubles, be an informant. And let's pray for the innocent prisoners. And let's talk to the a Nigeria ambassador. I heard that there's a new uh, ambassador. Let's talk to them so that they can fight for the Nigerians. Let's question Dr. Stephanie Casalani, that evil, evil, evil persecutor. Now they call her. Another affair. Dr. Stephanie Casalani, he has arrested more than 500 Nigerians for unknown crime. Just say, call them mafia. And when you ask him, go and go go it. Go go it. You see, Dr. Stephanie Casalani, people that he have arrested, ask whether they don't get one single proof. All the cases without trial, Casalani never provide one proof. They have a trick of doing it. You go saying they think they want to do something. Now make an arrest them. Why you not know conclude your investigation? Say they do the thing before you persecute them. I remember vividly, even there is a bar in one place called Coloniano in Treviso. One bar. One woman get out. What in a Cameroon and Nigerian woman? I don't know. Maybe she might be listening to me. When I want to do my better, I went there. I never knew she was working with the police. As I pay for the location with my document, she go tell police. They go put camera. I don't know. But I did my best successfully. But could you believe? It was one of the police that tell me, say, they put camera. Say, when I do bed, they provide, they show me camera, everything. They say, that woman. Ah, I meet the woman. I say, madam, are you working with the police? Say, no. They say, eh, anyone just tell me, they invite her to go to the police station one day, because they ask her, who be this person? I say, madam. So now, so you say they carry Nigerians. Say they give police for colonial that bar they call her red bar that woman she's a police informant and i laugh i say but my god pass you this one happened years ago why am i telling you that not everybody you see are your friends be careful of where you go of what you do especially with your document don't use your document for somebody not vow for anybody not use your document for person car you don't know what that person they do with your car. What you want to do with that car? No. No, use your document back, put document for house or person. You don't know what that person they do for inside that house. It can give you a problem. Now, how advice I advise you? I know some of your friends, they need it, but not do one. Don't be this kind of help that they do for person. Because your document is your identity. That anything will happen, they will know through your documents. But if you use something valid for somebody, if anything comes up, how will you defend yourself? We they pray, make we be the help. But we they pray, make we not do help. We will give us problem. I don't want with people. It by fire. Some people I will put document, put there for us, put for us for them. But at the end, now me go to go they pay the money for us when they leave. I don't know what they do inside there, because we want to show one Nigeria. We want to show that love. So you go put document for their car. They go take carry. Muta, 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 muta. Then when you go tell them, go tell you, say, now nah, you start to put document on a person's car. How can we come together? We have divided mind, divided nation. I beg. I beg. I beg on Nigerians. Stay away from crimes. Italy is a racist country. You know, favor with Nigerians. They take away Nigeria as rag, as dirty, as thieves, as criminals. They target us, they call us a name, mafia. 
So anything where you do, whether on your own or with people, you are be targeted mafia. If you sell small drug, they'll call you mafia. If you, you do my business, they'll call you mafia. If you beat your girlfriend, they'll call you mafia. If you get Africa shop, they'll call you mafia. If you follow people, go club, they fight, they'll call you a mafia. Anything you do for Italy, if they arrest you, go check out for telly or chronicle that they call them. They'll write Italian, they'll write Nigeria mafia. And I be the title. Telly go carry everything. And after the old case, the court said you not be mafia. What of the one that they write against you? How do you want to cancel now? They are process for Italy. You feel they for prison for 10 years, they'll see they do process. There are some cases that go abad on you. There are some cases in Italy 20 years ago, now they get the case, and now they are arresting. So 15 years ago, now they are arresting. They have one kind of bad BD justice system where I know that they're not clear. Be like, piri 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 piri. Not clear. That is where. As we did Italy, more they very careful. We respect the law. If the country don't let you stay, come out. Don't go get problem. Many people they die for prison. We you know they know. Many they sick. And you will get friend for prison. You will get brother for not abandon now. You will get husband for prison or wife, not abandon now. Not be fault. A lot of things we don't do, you know, if you understand. They write a letter. They pray for her. They send us also money. Police don't call arrest you. Two people know they do. One person don't go to prison. No fear, they don't call arrest you because you're not clean. You know, miss me, you know, send one 10 euro. 10 euro for prison and money. Come on, letter now, now something. Come on, letter now, something for prison. Money now, something for prison. 10 euro, 5 euro. Now, big thing for prison. If you know anybody, Help her, pray for her, write her, care for her, show love to the person. Italy not good for Nigeria. They don't the target to say we are black goat. No use brain. Do you know how many Nigerians don't do fabrica for that country? You feel tell me how many don't pension for Italy. How many Nigerians don't pension? You feel mention one. You know, I'm not sure say they. No Nigerian don't ever work with that country may passion. Either you work with that country, they give you problem. Either you work with that country, they kill you. Either you work with country, or you come out for the country. We they labor in vain. We they do everything to make sure that the country be good, but they'll target us. Because most of us don't spread the name of that country. But not be every Nigerian's by bad. We suffered a lot of crimes. We suffered a lot of injustice. A lot of racism. Nigerian embassy, wake up, stand up, fight for your Nigerians. Stop allowing the Italians to deal with Nigerians. Fight for the right of your country people. Not join Italy, condemn your fellow citizen. Even if they say na mafia, fair go find out whether that person na real mafia. Not just say na mafia, you accept that you condemn the person. Join her. The person will be open on his embassy. Embassy, no, if we can see you in case of your trial. If they feel deal with the ex commissioner of those states, Mr. Ero Semege, if they feel deal with commissioner working on that governor, who can be you? Who can be me? Who be we? First, we get level. They deal with them. Who can be me and you? We are rag before them. Italy don't care about your fabrica. They don't care about what you do for. They don't care about your tasks. They use the thing that will dump you. Just like waiting. Many directors they do for their company. So use it and dump you, use it and dump you, use it and dump you. They believe if you go on that person, you will come. You should be very, very wise. Let's stop killing ourselves. Isha, Bini, Uroba, Yoruba, Aosa, we are one. Wherever we see ourselves, we we'll love ourselves. Make we help ourselves. If I did go wrong, call my attention, correct me. Not go give my information to police. Make I not go give your information to police because I need documents or I need money. Yes, I was opportune. Police don't come give me money. Make I work with as an informant. I know they are down. They don't come meet me. But I refused. Say I not go feel doing because my conscience not go let me do it. Work with you as waiting. I say for to do what? When I they work with the country, I did leg everything. They say they know. But they know say because I didn't talk comedy and music. See, I know many people. So they want to send me at different places. Africa shop and other people they invest in. For waiting, I'll be police. I refuse. 
and those have contributed to one, some of my problems, which I have all the documents, I have all the secrets, and they wait for the right time. And they wait for the right time. But I know all this. I know the business between the, the Nigerian embassy and the police and the persecutor. I know the business where they transpire. I know the business how European Union take the fund Italy to the arrest mafia, not Nigeria, but they'll put out from Nigeria edge. How can a prison where they say make it contain 30,000 people, but Italian prison contain 65,000 people? Your the world they cry. Italy, reduce your prison people. Reduce this thing. They will pass a law. Say, not until you condemn that person after the first trial, second, the third, not put that for you for prison. But Italy will put you before the, before the will the first trial, they'll put you for prison. Where they never know that you're guilty or not. Italy, they hope a lot of people money where they want to pay. They don't pay correction, billions of money. Because many of the people they arrest at the end, they found them not guilty. I don't want to pay them. Big money. Then you begin battle that case again for another 10 years. How you want to get those kind of money? To take pay for injustice method against you. Which patient? Let us just say they arrest at the age of 50 or 60. You don't spend 30 years of prison. They call at the end and say you are not guilty. It, it doesn't sound well. It doesn't sound well. No proper investigation is done. As long as you are a black man, they throw you there. As long as you are a black man, Nigerian, Nigerian especially that green passport, that possibly like a course. Yeah? Supposedly the opportunity they will uh, fit a change green passport or change them. But I love my country. I love Nigeria, my country. Why they see say green passport? They'll say this man. Ah, you are a Nigerian. Anywhere you go, they see you they run. Yes. I know they don't say Nigerians, all of they are good. Not be everybody. We have good Nigerians. We have those that are working. We have those that are paying their tasks. We have those that are respecting the laws. We should not use one thing to qualify everybody. So that means in Niger Italy is not our place. Italy is not our place. Like the book I wrote, there are two kinds of books. One, the future for Nigerians. Not in Italy. The futures for Nigeria, not it. The other one is the Italian business, Italian prison business. How can a man suffer for 20 years? They do fabric company work for Italy. You finish that work and then your picking will continue. We go to the throw cartoon. Your picking cannot be a lawyer, cannot be a nurse, cannot be a pilot, cannot be the drive train, cannot be the work for office, inside company. Check other European country. Your children, their future have limelight. They have bright light. They can work in the airport, can work in the ticket office, can work as a doctor, as a nun. But in Italy, how many of our children don't feel workers because they raise, they don't give it up to the rich region? How many black people did for parliament or Italy? Only the one way they did quick and throw away. Enough people possible. But go other European country, they'll see black all over. They are children, they are doctors, they are, they are footballers. What happened to Mario Balotelli? How many, how many black men did for the national team? If you would, they want year through your lucky country away. So, Nigerians, wake up. Italy is not a place for your, the future for your children. Except you don't mean well for your children. If you mean well, that country, to break that barrier, is very, the, the, the Italy is their programmer. Now, program country. Come, let me explain to you how they take program Italy. Now, the program of Italy is within Italy. But for prison, they share them. They say if 80 Italians did prison, to complete a hundred, they'll use 20 blacks. That is the program. Every year they do one. That is why you decide they raid for Italy. Now program. Now, if that 20 they fair arrest, they come out, they'll come bring 40. Because black must cover that space. With the door program for Italy, for that prison. So when the prison door is empty, they will go do raiding again. That is why you see they always they do raiding two times a year for Italy because it is a program country to feed the prison with blacks. Now when they come because before they be the arrest blacks, they give them one year. But now they give you that four one six beast code where beast of fifty arrest more than fifty hundred and your sentence now for ten years, fifty years go up. When you not commit, you not keep peace, you not keep hope, you not keep police, you not do drug business, you not do human trafficking. They will say you not mafia. Me not understand. What did be mafia? No, I don't understand. When somebody that, that is, this what they parole me. What did be mafia? 
You know what is called mafia? The crime of a mafia. We be say the Italian mafia, where they produce, where they produce mafia, where they, they suffer. They'll do inside prison. They'll be boss. They get full. They get they be big men for inside prison. They they live where not be mafia. Nigeria they suffer. You they call the mafia for inside prison. Never see money to pay lawyer. Never money to eat. They call a mafia. Ah, mafia with mafia. Wait. Mafia waiting. I beg. Nigeria ambassadors. Nigeria ambassador for Italy. Fight for your innocent people. They are languishing in the prison with the code of 416 with mafia. He not exist. He not they. If the person is not confronting anything, he join, join anything, he bone you anything, he can't fight, he can't do it. Charge him. Okay, if you say the person join a bone, for example, you bone in a crime for Italy. Say so you can't join a bone, you not fight, you don't in a crime. I don't understand. Not, 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 not when the person do something, not be there, they say the person commit crime. No, I don't understand. So you could just say because the person joined Ogboni, the person is not a mafia. You will not do anything, no. You know the reason why I joined Ogboni, for example. No. I beg. I beg Nigerians, let's stop killing ourselves. Let's stop being a police informant. Let's respect the little law they have in Italy. So that we will not fall victims of circumstances. Let's think of what we are doing, where we are going. Any group you belong to, cut yourself from that group. Because Italian, if you join any group, is from 10 years, 15 years. Come out your hands from group. Be single. School one. Go. Group not get who they help. Group not get who they help. Group not give you food. Group not they pay your ass rent. Group, not to feed your wife and your children. Run away from group. Stay alone. Look for good work. Take care of your family. If you reach a kind level, carry your family and your children. Go get a better education for another land. Because Italy, your children, where you born for them, they are doomed. Sorry to say I use this language because your picking of it become a doctor, a nurse, a parliamentarian. Person they drive train. Person they drive bus. You know what happen for Italy? Out of, I mean, if maybe they say if we go be one, one a percent in a pass mark. But go France, go Germany, go America, go London, go Canada. I mean, you see, we are blacks, Nigerians, are even the best. They work hard. They are the best. They, they are engaged in all kind of activities. But Italy, no. Dr. Stephanie Casalani, the persecutor in Torino, stop arresting Nigerians. For crime they know nothing about. Free them from the prison. Those that are going to appear, Casalani free them. Dr. Stephanie Casalani, the persecutor of Torino, free Nigerians. The Nigerian ambassador fight for Nigerians. All the police informant, Nigerians police informant, repent. Before God will send his wrath upon you people. As I end up these brokers, I'm still begging. Police from Nigerians, repent wherever you are. Because my next program, I'm going to make sure your name. You will stay Torino, Verona, Palermo, Anona. I'll call on her name. I'll call on her name to advise on her. Many people they see on the wrong. Many people they see know the kind of friends where they get. Many people they know the kind, whether you be brother or sister. Because you define document and money, then you will put your new sembra for prison. And you, when they do things where not clear, try to come out your hand. I beg you, come out your hand. Look your wife's face and your children's face. Look for a good job to take care of them. And God will bless you. Crime not be everything. In legal way of getting money, it's not your way. It's not always the right way. I've been in this country. I've never sold my hand in anything illegal, and God has been blessing me. That same God can say bless you. Crime is not everything. Share this video to your loved ones, to your friends. May they take this advice. They grow. We are going to be organizing a protest against the injustice against the Nigerians in Italy, 
we are going to organize a protest against Dr. Stephanie Kasalani putting Nigerians into prison. We are going to organize a protest against Nigerian embassy that is currently destroying Nigeria, that is collecting money from the Nigerians, that is collecting money from the Italian people, the police, to support them, to keep quiet. May they not feel fight for Nigeria. We are going to organize a protest against this set of people. May they stop arresting Nigeria illegally. Nigeria Embassy, speak out. Stand for your brother and your sister. You are our father and our mother. No matter what they see that person do, go visit that person. Ask her, what that person do? Not join the police, the persecutor. They condemn your fellow citizens. Not think you all Nigerian are the same. Mm, you say all of them are the same. All of them are the same. Why are you our ambassador? Are you there to only collect money? As the Italian police and the persecutor, they collect money for the European Union. Make you not see that part they collect from the Italian government because your family. My brother, my sister, you will be the ambassador. You will be the work for that embassy. Make I tell you, God, day. you remember the story of the one with the first sleep when not wake up. Get we got to do the things. You will feel say you will feel live with the blood of the innocent Nigerian. God will visit you for your sleep. Ambassador, if you go decide, not like the former one, this new one, I believe you are going to do your best. And I believe that God is going to help you. Not follow the full step of the former one. That one is a corrupt ambassador when I don't ever see. Very corrupt. So, as I round up, this is my second video. The third one, we are going to talk in details about this 416 bis. Will be the criminal mafia code. Will give permission to the Italian police to arrest more than 500 persons at the same time. This code is not made for Nigerians. It's made for the Italians. So you cannot use the Italian code for Nigerian, called the Nigerian Mafia. When Nigeria are not even practicing the Mafia, you go arrest a Nigerian man, you not go see gun, you not see cocaine, you not see Igbo, you not see anything, you not see prostitution, you not see transportation of arms, you not go see international court, you go see na Mafia. They will put that for their news, you have to damage the name of that person and the family, but you will call her Mafia. God will the evil, you not go ever forget and forgive. The persecutor where they do this thing and the in Nigerian informant where they do this thing. Make could not take time. Take time. I also know say there are some other inf police informants in Treviso. Mona do for good work. Repent before the fire of God will visit you. Life is not what you think it is. So there are a lot of things that happen. Our president for Nigeria they misbehave. We will they more join out together, more help ourselves. You know somebody where in their prison, visit the wife, visit the children, write a letter, send her five euro, ten euro. It will make and they happy. It go it go make and say no say people they remember her. To write somebody letter, not they take anything. Police not go find you. Ah, my brother, how are you there? I see your wife, I see your picking. He did the person you read that letter, he go happy where well, where. Well. He not go to the feeling. Wife, visit your husband, write a letter. He go know that somebody care for not abandon her. I know say not easy. But I they beg. We should not abandon anybody. They not commit the crime. Where would they feel say they commit? No. Yes, they feel commit some, but not the all the crime where the government put for their head. No. I have experienced it, I've seen it, I know what they are talk about. Many are still in the prison. I keep praying for death daily. And I know one day, and before this year will run out, I know God is going to free many of them in the name of Jesus Christ. So as we plan for our protest against racism, against illegal arrest, arrest without warrant, against all the informants in Nigeria, against the brutality of Nigeria. Italian injustice system. Dr. Stefani Castellan, the persecutor of Torino, stay away from Nigeria. Stay away from Nigeria. Stop arresting them, but arrest those that are committing crime and evil. 
and you Nigerian try to be a good citizen. Do things that are legal, not to bring disgrace to our nation. Make a live now. Now always me your apostle. As I felt on today not be preaching day. I just put this message. Make a put on take talk to our people. As our ex commissioner don't come out, we will support her to fight against this racism. And the last thing I want to talk, all Nigerians in Italy are not the same you could run. If you know say that your future of your children not match that country, you want to make your picking be great. That is why you they suffer. Think above. The future of our children not the Italy. Our children not fit become anything. They're not go agree. Me, you become a footballer, a doctor, a nurse, a pilot, they're not go agree. So think of how you go to relocate, train your picking into a good place. Where you go fit become person tomorrow. I make you the suffer. Now I make me the suffer so that our children will get a better future. That is our struggle. And I believe God there with us. That God will deal with me. He deal with you now too. He will bless you now. And any informant will decide to repent. Go to any church that will pray for you. Me, for me, I don't get anything against you. I don't forgive you. I don't pray for you. But things say everybody not be the same. You get the other place where you feel offend. You go feel pass another way around. Because you get picking, you get wife. Not because of money or dog will go put your wife and your picking or your mama your prayer for trouble. Because you want to become a police informant. God bless you. As I round up. Till I meet you again. Wanna take care. Now bye bye.